Alan Rosenfield was born in Cambridge, Massachusetts. His early exposure to medicine visiting hospitals on weekends on the edges of Boston with his father, a notable doctor, influenced Alan as he began to dream about following in his father's footsteps. As an adult, he forged his own medical path receiving degrees from Harvard College and Columbia University. He also served for two years in the U.S. Air Force. He then entered residency for obstetrics and gynecology at what is now Brigham and Women's Hospital. Following completion of training in 1966, Dr. Rosenfield spent one year as an instructor in the Department of Obstetrics and Gynecology at the University of Lagos Teaching Hospital in Nigeria. He then joined the Population Council, serving for six years in Thailand as medical advisor for family planning, as well as maternal and child health to the Ministry of Public Health, and as representative of the Population Council. Allen returned to the Grand Campus of Columbia University in 1975, this time as Professor of Obstetrics, Gynecology, and Public Health, then as Founding Director of the Center for Population and Family Health. He quickly rose in 1986 to the Dean of the Mailman School of Public Health, where he raised the bar for students and faculty and cemented a historic legacy. Dr. Rosenfield's world-renowned research, teaching, and advocacy earned him extensive national and international recognition. Also an accomplished writer, he published more than 140 articles on women's reproductive health, HIV AIDS, human rights, and notably on maternal mortality. With the 1985 journal article, Maternal Mortality, a Neglected Tragedy, Where is the M in Maternal Child Health? which sparked major global discussion on the importance of a woman's health during pregnancy. From his career beginnings in Nigeria and Thailand, to promoting reproductive and maternal health among young adults in Washington Heights and Harlem. Here in New York, the Center for the Advancement of Women is proud to honor Alan Rosenfield's lifetime commitment to women's health. We thank him for changing the landscape for a brighter future for all women.